Princess Kate and Prince William choose their summer holiday destinations just like us. Over the years, the Wales family has holidayed in some fabulous locations, including the Isles of Scilly, Balmoral and the Caribbean island of Mystique, and while these three destinations are all incredibly different, they do have something in common, and it's likely why they're beloved by Prince William and Princess Kate. The Wales parents are both huge lovers of the outdoors, and this certainly factors into their destinations of choice. While a lie-down holiday somewhere exotic such as the Maldives might be appealing to many, Prince William and Princess Kate love to stay active on holiday, especially with walking, hence their choices of location. Welcome to Royal Pancakes. If you are new here, please don't forget to subscribe and click the notifications bell, so you don't miss any news about the British monarchy. Prince William spoke of his love of a stroll in 2021, writing on Instagram, My whole family has a passion for walking, whether it's my grandmother still taking her corgis out at 95, my father embarking on lengthy rambles over the summer in Scotland, or my own children making their first appearance at our annual walk to church on Christmas morning at Sandringham. Princess Kate confirmed that she is relying on outdoor time and walks during her preventive chemotherapy, sharing a message that read, I know the power of nature to support our development and well-being, both by bringing us joy and helping to keep us physically, mentally and spiritually healthy. The Balmoral estate is known to be heaven for walking, with King Charles fond of traversing the hills on the property's ground, Queen Camilla even had a fall while hiking there in 2010. The Queen Consort, who was 62 at the time, took a tumble while on her annual Easter break with her husband, with the couple's official spokesman explaining the Queen Consort would be in plaster for at least six weeks. While rather different from the Scottish Highlands, the Caribbean island of Mystique, where the Wales family spent Prince George's sixth birthday, is a paradise of walks. The island's website claims, the hiking trails on Mystique are wonderfully varied. Every route will help you discover the extraordinary biodiversity of the island, dash, sounds perfect for the walking whales. Cornwall boasts some of the UK's best walks, and the Scilly Isles, off the Cornish coast, promises brilliant hikes too, with the area's official website writing, the Isles of Scilly is an archipelago made for walking. Unspoilt, untouched and truly peaceful, you can enjoy the spectacular coastal paths, nature trails, fields of flowers and top-to-toe island walks year-round. We hope Princess Kate, Prince William and the kids are having a great time, wherever they're walking. The Prince and Princess of Wales are no doubt enjoying spending some much-needed quality time with their children, Prince George, Princess Charlotte, and Prince Louis, now that the royal kids have broken up from school for the holidays. The summer weeks are often full of traditions for the royal family, who typically head up to stay at the King's Balmoral Estate in Scotland. King Charles and Queen Camilla will be enjoying an extended stay at their residence this year, but it's unknown whether the Wales family will be joining them. What is certain, however, is that their time off will offer the family some time away from the stresses of public engagements, busy schedules and school runs, not to mention provide a welcome distraction for Kate who has been undergoing preventative chemotherapy treatment since the beginning of the year. William, 42, has been undertaking royal engagements solo while Kate, also 42, has been receiving her medical treatment following abdominal surgery in January. However, the Princess of Wales did make a triumphant appearance at the King's official birthday celebrations in June and stepped out to watch the Wimbledon finals at the All England Lawn and Tennis Club, of which she is a patron. If the family of five are heading to Balmoral Castle for their summer break, it'll be the change of scenery and gorgeous landscape that will relieve the royal couple of any stresses they may have. Family psychologist, Professor Helen Dodd, who has teamed up with Redrow Homes for new research on outdoor play and nature, spoke to Hello. About the importance of children getting out and getting active, but also how important a break is for parents.